Hey yo, what is up guys? It's Sam back on the channel here. Listen, hey, look at that. Snowy season. No kidding now. It is freezing. Normally I'd be out here in a hoodie or out here in a vest jogging. We've got a full coat today because we don't know about this weather. But I'm going to try and make this a quick one because I don't know how much storage my phone's got. Storage on my phone recently has just been fucked. We don't know why, but shit. It's been pretty bad. I'm trying to make this an unfiltered video. I was originally going to do it with a camera angle, like vertical, but we move. I'm trying to do it like this because, you know, I feel like more of a vlogger. But I might be a little rusty with the camera because I've not come on and spoke to you guys on filling in here in a, on, in a while. But today, I want to talk about the power of visualization. So, if you guys know what visualizing is, of course, it's when you picture a certain place that you want to be at you know you f you feel the feelings you smell the smells you hear what there is to hear and you feel the emotions you would feel if you were in that place and though i like to do this when i'm like listening to music and stuff you know i have my favorite music playing i imagine i'm in like a nice car or something and you know, i've got the, i've got the life that i want i've achieved a lot of the things that i want and it's just nice to think about it's like okay cool so this is my goal and here's what I want to strive to achieve. And in a few years time, if I keep doing what I'm doing and pursuing what I'm pursuing and doing different things to experiment and achieving more of my goals and setting goals, I'll eventually end up in this place. And it's a cool feeling because it's like, I know I can achieve this, right? So why would I not go out of my way to try that? And one of the best things you can do to actually achieve that is to visualize now whether you believe it or not visualization is the key to actually achieving the majority of your goals just think about it if you didn't visualize it first and understand that that is what you actually want to achieve why would you go to achieve it in the first place right if you didn't know that was your goal by sitting there in real time well not in real time but let me change hands because my arm's fucking hurting. This coat's heavy. But, and I had a gym yesterday. But, you wouldn't know if you, it's your goal if you've actually been there and kind of felt it. You know what I mean? Like, if you, if you go, if you visualize it and feel what it would feel like to actually be there, then you're going to want to achieve it more. And you're going to know that's what you actually want. Switching arms again. Fucking hell. But, yeah, so power of visualization is made easier when you set goals and achieve them now achieving goals like it could be anything it could be something as small as going up and approaching a girl or something it could be it could be as small as that but if you set a goal and you achieve it you'll start to notice that a lot of the things that you say start to come true and it's like you should write down even if it's something as small as just like a morning routine if you write that down and achieve it let's say even just like brushing your teeth and going to eat breakfast if you write that shit down and then you achieve it if you write the next thing down you're a lot more likely to achieve that and you'll notice that and i've been noticing that for a good long while now a good few years so it kind of relates to this Andrew Tate quote I saw as well. I mean, it came up on my YouTube feed and I really resonated with it because it's something I've been experiencing for years. It's like when, you stick, when you're a man of your word and you do what you say you're going to do, a lot of the time, all the things that you just say will start coming true or like all the things that you even think will just start coming true. Like you'll, you'll visualize seeing someone and you'll end up seeing them. Just little shit like that, like even happened to me the other day, like, and I, I visualized I was gonna see one of my old friends and I seen him. So, it's kind of weird, but yeah, so the power of visualization is like, just thinking about your goals and thinking what you're gonna feel when you achieve those goals and shit. And it's so powerful because if you, to, to achieve your visualizations, if you put this thing into, into work, into play, of like writing down what one of your goals is and then achieving that goal no matter how big or small it is 
some of the things that you start to think and start to say. Because think about it, you have to think about something before you write it down. So if you think about it first, and then go on to write it down, and then achieve that thing, it's the same as thinking about something and that thing happening. Think about it, guys. It's this, if you go, if you think about something, and then write it down, and then achieve that thing, or that thing comes true because you made it happen, it's the same as thinking about something and that thing happening. Or the same as writing something down and it happening. Or saying something and it happening, which is where affirmations come from. You know, if you say certain things and then make them happen, all the things that you say will just happen on autopilot. That's how the game works, guys. That's how the spiritual game works. Whether you like it or not, that's how the game works, baby. That's it. That's literally the game. And this is a video that I hope to come back to myself. You know, this is this is a video that I made for not just for you guys, but for myself as well. Because in the future, when I come back to watch this, and I'm probably watching this right now, but in the future, when I come back to watch this, I will remember the system and how it works, and then I can use it to my advantage and manifest the things that I want into my life on autopilot through achieving. And visualizing but that's the power of visualization guys you set these goals and you achieve them through visualization that was a fucking cow and um, <laughs> and then the rest happens on autopilot but first you have to visualize everything because if you visualize something you become 10 times more motivated to get it and you know exactly what it is you want rather than just you know, searching for it blindly, being like, oh, I just want women in cars, and women in supercars. But if you write down in detail the ex exact woman that you like, or the exact supercar that you like, and then you strive towards that, that's visualization. Because you've been to where you want to be in your mind, and you translate that into your reality. So I hope this video did make sense, guys. If any of it did, please let me know in the comments if you want me to make a video on something else. And if you like this video style, this video format of me just speaking to the camera and filter about my thoughts and opinions, let me know in the comments down below. And yeah, guys, stay woke.